In today's tech tip, I'll be showing you how to convert a WebP image file to a PNG file. So this is a WebP. You can confirm that by right clicking and checking the properties. So as you can see, clearly this is WebP image file format. So I'll be showing you how to convert this online to a PNG. So what you want to do is go to your favorite browser and then go to this website at imageconverter.site. Now, of course, you can use any online tool that you want, but for this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to use this one, which is my favorite, and I also recommend you to use this one. It works very well. So imageconverter.site, I'll leave this link in the description below. So here, all you need to do is click on Browse Files. That's going to open File Explorer, and then you can navigate to where you saved your image file, your WebP image file. Now mine is right here in the in the desktop in a folder called images, as you can see. So click on the file and then click on open. And that's going to upload our web WebP image file into onto this website. Now you can also see you can convert up to 10 images at the same time and the maximum file size is 50 MB. So anyway, once the upload is complete, this bar will turn green and it also say upload complete. So the next thing you want to do is choose the file format you want to convert to. So click on this drop down arrow and from the options, select PNG. And then in the image quality slider, the default is set to 80%. If you want lower quality output, you can select a lower version of the end result. But if you're like me and you like 100% best quality, then you need to push that slider all the way to the right. That will make sure you have the same quality of image after conversion. After you do that, then simply click on convert. So once it's done, you can now see our image is now a PNG image file. And all you have to do now is download it onto your computer. So click on download and then the file explorer will appear again. Choose where you want to save your downloaded image file. I'll just save mine in the same folder, but you can save it exactly where you want. All right. So click on save. And that's it. So now you can now navigate to where you saved your image file. And now when you check on properties, you can see we have a PNG image file and this is our original WebP image file. And you can actually even check the quality. You can see our PNG image file is still at the highest quality compared to our original WebP image file. Thanks for watching. Leave your comments and questions down below and good luck.